The Dash Pay wallet has launched, bringing a new era of ease of use to crypto payments. It's available to all Android users, with iOS coming soon after. You can now register a username and add others to your contact list for easy, seamless payments all on the blockchain. Dash's username setup also boosts your privacy by acting as a stealth address that generates new one-time payment addresses automatically without publicly exposing them. Combined with CoinJoin, this is a very robust privacy setup for your digital cash. Here's how to set it up. First, go to the app store you use, or you can get an APK file from the GitHub linked in the description. Look up DashPay and download and install it. If you were using the older version of Dash Wallet, before it was called DashPay, it should be updated and ready to use. If you already have a different Dash Wallet from somewhere and backed up, restore the wallet and enter your recovery phrase. If you're a first time user, when you get your recovery phrase, back it up, hand write it down on a piece of paper and save it somewhere safe. Do not screenshot it, take a picture of it, or type it out in a text file somewhere. The less it touches anything connected to the internet, the safer it is. Now you need some Dash. If you didn't restore a wallet, you'll need to either transfer some in or otherwise buy some. To do that, go wherever you either have or can buy Dash, then go in the wallet and go to receive. Copy that address or scan the QR code and send Dash to that address. You can also buy Dash right in the wallet through a few different ways. If you already have a Coinbase or Uphold account, you can connect those so that your purchases automatically end up in the wallet. But the easiest way is through Topper. Select this option, enter the amount you want to buy, enter payment details and basic info about yourself, hit buy, and Dash should show up in your wallet soon. Once you have some Dash and the wallet is fully synced, you should see an option to join DashPay appear. Now, for privacy reasons, it's recommended to enable CoinJoin before registering your username. You don't have to do this step, but you probably should if you want to break linkage between your funds and the username registration transaction. Go to the menu, then Settings, then select the CoinJoin option, pick your desired level of privacy, then press Start Mixing. Let it run in the background until done. This is faster if you enable running in the background under settings. Once you have funds ready to go, join DashPay and register your username. Note that there are two different kinds of username, regular and premium. If you want to register a long username or one with more numbers than zero and or one, you get it immediately for a very small fee. But if you want a premium username, you need to pay a higher fee and wait two weeks while the network votes to see if you can get the username. This is to prevent impersonation, scamming, and someone just buying up all the good names to resell for huge prices later. Of course, you should get a really nice username and wait two weeks, but if you need to start adding contacts right away or don't care about having a particularly unique name, you can get the regular non-premium kind. Once you have your username, look up other users in the contacts window and add them as friends. Once a contact is formed, you can send private payments easily to the username. Keep checking back as we're constantly adding extra features such as the ability to register multiple usernames as well as merchant maps, spending tools, and more. Welcome to the new era of digital cash. Private, instant, easy to use, intuitive, just works.